Interpreter Relays with PHP Hop, this time on Metasploit Minute. This Metasploit Minute is brought to you by Hack5 and viewers like you. Support us directly at hakshop.com. Welcome to Metasploit Minute, the breakdown on breaking in. I'm Rob Fuller, but you can call me Mubix. This time we're going to be taking you through a specific payload type um, called the PHP hop and, and script junkie um, Matthew Weeks has created this payload and it's in, in trunk right now so you can actually use it right now. One of the coolest things about this thing is it's just a PHP file that you put on a server somewhere um, that allows you to relay through that public IP or that other IP to get Windows sessions. So let's say that I'm behind a uh, NAT, um, a, like a, a firewall, a NATing firewall, and, and the target is behind a NATing firewall, but I'm somehow able to, via fish or whatever, be able to get to them and execute code. Well, I can't, I mean, I could port forward on my firewall to get things going, or I could just use this really cool thing called the hot payload. First off, I need to actually put that PHP file somewhere. And that PHP file lives in slash or data php hop.php in the Metasploit framework directory. And you can find that on any updated version of Metasploit, wherever you put Metasploit, um, the Metasploit framework. So I'm gonna cat that right now. You can see it's it's a relatively short um, PHP file, and you can uh, I think there are a few things you can edit, including the the uh, magic thing, um, the magic token that allows it to know that a session's coming in instead of something else. And you can add a few things in here, and then all you do is put it onto a server. And I've already put this on the Hack5 demo server, which is up there on the, on the cloud somewhere. Um, and we are going to use it against a local host. Now, I'm doing this simply because I have two hosts, and they're VMs, and they're there. And it would be a little hard to kind of set up um, a couple of natting things. Um, but you get the point. Everything's going to be routing through this one public IP. So if I do a show options, I've actually set all of everything up already. You already know all of these options that are up on the top, the R host, the R port, the SMB password, the SMB um, user. The difference is, is the payload. I've selected a Windows Meterpreter reverse hop HTTP. And there's a few other hop based payloads and I'll show you those after I'm done here. But the, the thing is, I don't have a local host or a local port. I'm just saying the hop URL is X. That way, it's actually going out over 80, hitting the, uh, the hop PHP file that's on my remote server, as well as the reverse HTTP um, interpreter session coming from the victim. So I'm going to exploit that, and we're gonna watch the logs over here as that's going on inside of um, the remote host. So you can see the update.php is being um, called with control and these other commands with post and get. Um, and you'll also see on this side that I now have a interpreter session. So PS works just fine. I can do all of the post modules, everything. Oops. Um, uh, get system, uh, use memcats, and all of the fun stuff that you can do with, uh, with interpreter. And it's all going through this in intermediary or, or relay of the, the hop.php. And that's it. That's really all there is to it. Um, so I'll show you real quick. I, I promised you that I'd show the other payloads. So search, search hop should give me just a bunch of stuff, but you, what you need to look at is the bottom ones. So we're the DLL inject, interpreter, shell, upload exec, and VNC inject, you get them all with the hop payload or the hop stager um, or stage or whichever one. I get that mixed up all the time and I'm sure you do too. So. Um, that's all there is to it, and um, tell me what you think. If um, at msf at hack5.org, stay tuned to metasploitminute.com for shows like these. And thanks again for supporting the show. If you want to support us even more, you can go to hakshop.com and enter code MUBIX and get free Metasploit stickers. Until next time, I'm MUBIX, and I'll be hacking till the cows come home.
You know, I just read that, and it's Rob Ruler. <laughs> I'm, I'm really curious if I said Rob Ruler in the last two segments. <laughs>